What's going on guys? Michigan Gander Man Rob here and today I am the in the beautiful little town of Hamilton, Michigan. And we are here today to see some pretty real really cool sights, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hit that like, hit that share, hit that subscribe button, and let's get this tour on the road, guys. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Now this, guys, has got to be the coolest mailbox I have ever seen. It's a Harley Davidson. Somebody took a Harley Davidson frame with the tank and everything and turned it into a mailbox. That's cool. That is definitely cool. Now we are in Riverside Cemetery, guys, in Hamilton, Michigan. Although this is this is a really, really old cemetery, there is something very, very cool and unique I want to show you guys. Not just all the old historic headstones and all the history in this museum or this uh, cemetery, but there is something very cool that I want to show you. Let's go take a look, guys. This right here, guys, in, inside the cemetery, this is Potter's Field. And here's a little story about it. Potter's Field, as reported in an article of the Hamilton Press in September of 1950, an Indian burial ground had been discovered 50 years prior on the Hein Brower Farm. Displeased by the people who came to the farm digging for Indian relics, Mr. Brower had the entire area dug up and any remains were put into containers. It is unknown whether these Indians are part of the Potawatomi tribe that inhabit, inhabited Hamilton after the discovery, or if they belong to earlier tribes of the era. The Indian relics remain buried in the potter's field today. And this is Potter Field, and this is where all the Indian relics are buried at. Somewhere in this area. And there is no headstones or anything to tell where he buried them all at but right in this fenced in area is potter's field and this is where he buried the indian relics let's go take a look inside a minute guys hmm. Mm 
There's a nice old headstone here. Definitely. Unlegible. Right next to this big old tree. And we have Charles Whitcuck, 1907 to 1936. <laughs> This says Albert Traven, Traven, World War One or World War Two veteran. Eighteen nineteen eighteen to nineteen eighty six. So the oldest headstone is the one right under the tree over there.
This is the Rabbit River in Hamilton, Michigan, guys. And right there, what you're looking at, that is the Hamilton Dam.